The Fighting Illini are on one of the hottest teams in the Big Ten right now, winning the last four games, and today they have a huge roadblock in front of them. Wisconsin looking for, they would take on Wisconsin at Wisconsin. The Cole Center first half, Badgers got rolling early. Frank Kaminsky, strong work from the baseline. He had the two, he had a huge day. First half, keep on going, Illini battle back. Austin Colbert spots up and knocks down the tray. He finished with three, five points on the day, but then Malcolm Hill decides to go up and put in his own three. Illinois goes up by one. Hill had 15, but Wisconsin came right back. Sam Decker with that steal goes the distance and throws it down. Decker had 10. Wisconsin won on a 17-2 run at the end of the first half into the second half. Here's part of that. The missed three, but watch the hustle by Nigel Hayes. Leads it to Bronson Cohen. Puts it up. He got another tray. The Badger just kept rolling. Ravante Rice, the Illini trying to get the counter. They got the hoop and the harm. Rice had 10 on the day, but Illinois unable to really get any steady ground against Wisconsin. No answer for Frank Kaminsky, also Frank the Tank. Team high of 23 points for the Badgers. Illini gets rocked in Madison, 68-49. News Channel Sports' Josh Getzoff is at the Kohl Center, and he has more. Hey, David. Well, it's no secret the Kohl Center has been a house of horrors for opponents, and today, no different, as Illinois simply beaten down by the Wisconsin Badgers, trailing for 32 of the 40 minutes, out-rebounded 32-26, to and beaten 68-49, to snapping a four-game winning streak. Obviously, they're really good. Um, I felt that way coming into the game watching film and when they have five guys that can dribble pass and shoot like that indicative of their four turnovers for the 40 minutes uh, makes them very difficult uh, to defend. And we didn't get the job done. When they got the offensive rebound it seemed like most of the time they scored off of it. It was just something we have to learn from, but we're not hanging our heads about it. The Badgers and Player of the Year candidate Frank Kaminsky came as advertised. Illinois had no answer for Frank the Tank as the senior led Wisconsin with 23 points in the win. He can shoot, pass, dribble, and he's smart, so uh, that's why like all those skills he has. I just I thought Kaminsky was terrific. Um, I, I thought that um, you know he scored it at all three levels of the court. He made very difficult shots. Uh, he passed it well, obviously had a double-double. I've -double. Uh, watched him play a lot. I think he's certainly one of the country's best players. Illinois now has a week off of game action and won't return to the floor until next Sunday when the Michigan State Spartans come to Champaign in a game that now for Illinois means a lot as far as their March Madness plans are concerned. At the Kohl Center in Madison, Josh Getzoff, News Channel Sports.